Here's the challenge for today. I will be limited to only using artificial baits. Well, my dad right here is gonna get to use live bait. Dad, who do you think's gonna win this fishing challenge today? Well, Michael, you know, the fish are pretty smart. You're using artificial bait. There's good news and bad news. All right. I think you're smart enough to outsmart the fish. That's the good news. The bad news is, that's not saying much. Fish have pretty small brains. <laughs> well, either way, I think it's gonna be a, a pretty interesting challenge and we're gonna see which bait is truly the best. Can I say one more thing? Yeah. Honestly, Michael, this competition, it's like you bringing a knife to a gunfight with me. <laughs> There's no way you can win. Before we get started, let's go over the baits that we'll be using. I have an assortment of swim baits and hard baits in all different sizes, and I also have an entire bag of bass fishing gear. That's for my dad. What do you got over here, dad? Well, let me start over here. Got some squid, alewives, blood worms, soft crabs, and I got a little special secret in this bag. You ready to see it? All right, open it up. What do you got in there? What I have in here will provide more action than your whole arsenal combined. <laughs> Let me just give you a little little idea of this. Watch this. You see this? Yeah, what was it? What's in there? Look at these guys. These guys. Whoa, they're going crazy. Whoa, he's gonna, he's, don't drop him, don't drop him. Whoa, whoa, right. whoa, whoa. Look get him at, back in the, the bag. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I, these guys are crazy. Look at the action of this guy. Yeah, this all right. This is going to own you and all your baits. All right, don't lose him. Don't lose guy. another freaking Holy eel, crap. Dad. All right, you got the towel? Get him, get him, get him. All right, I got him this time. All right, put him Without in. got the towel. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> this is going to catch the king rockfish today. <laughs> you think so? You're done. All right. Zero chance. <laughs> and if all those don't work, we also have live spot in here. Perfect bait fish size. You going to get him? I got him. I don't no. want you getting fined again, Dad. No, I, I want to You already embarrassed yourself rinse. last video. I want to rinse my hand. Okay, gotcha. All right, we're rigging up. Dad, what are you studying with first? Gonna use bloodworm. And uh, the interesting thing about a bloodworm is it can actually have a, uh, it has, what does it have, a sucker? What is it? I mean, is it called a bloodworm for what reason? I'll be honest, I don't know. <laughs> they uh, they suck the blood out of other creatures and they actually have a blood sucker. So if you put that thing down, put it down, try to uh, get the sucker to come out. Let's see if you can get it to come out and be careful, it can sting you. Oh my God, you never told me that. <laughs> you didn't know that? No, All right. are you kidding me? Let's see if you can get the sucker out. Oh, there it is! Look at that! Oh my gosh! Did you yeah, see that? yeah, that's Look crazy. That. So you, it has, actually has some sharp teeth at the end of it. Are you serious? That's, that's what crazy. it uses. That's what it uses to suck blood. Oh, there it there is! It is. Came there out. it is again. Yeah, came out. Oh, there Jesus. was. I saw it. Look at that thing. Oh my god! Oh my gosh! I don't know if I want to use these guys as bait now. They're scaring me. Ready to get started? Ready. So uh, we're gonna do a two-part challenge. Part one is gonna be a speed challenge. Oh, there's fish right behind you, actually. We're gonna see who can catch three fish first. What do you got rigged up over here? Let's see your rig over here. My dad's got the uh, top bottom rig. And interestingly, he only chose to rig up uh, one of the hooks. Interesting choice right there. Half ounce weight. What are you going for with that rig? Well, first let me tell you why I only rigged one of the hooks. Why? Because uh, I'm sort of giving you a little handicap. Handicap, okay. Oh, well, you think you can win. And right here, I'm just throwing the classic quarter ounce gold spinner. I think uh, you can probably catch perch, croaker, whatever's in here really. Uh, we're gonna see, ready? Let's do it. Fish on! What? <laughs> you got, oh my gosh. Woo! Is that a spot fish? Uh, yep, that's a spot. All right, all right, look at this, I told you. That's actually the exact bait we have in our bucket. <laughs> it's like taking candy from a baby. That was literally one minute you caught a fish. They call it bunker though. I mean, they call it bunker, but it's technically spot. All right, well there it goes. You wanna let him go? Oh, you got it, you can let it go. All right, we're gonna let this guy go. That's one. You need two more, Dad. Two more. That's quick. That's your very first cast. Within 20 seconds, you caught a fish. Well, you know what the key was? What? It was the no look over the shoulder cast. <laughs> very I'm nice. Using that all day today. <laughs> all right, all right. Handicap for you. <laughs> well, sounds good. Let's keep it rolling. Fish on. Number three. While well, I'm rigging up. I told you. All right. We'll see what you got. It's probably the same one. Smaller though. Oh, it's a double. <laughs> Holy oh, crap! It's a double white perch. A white I, perch and a spot croaker. <laughs> double. Double up. <laughs> all right. Hey, we can keep that one for bait, actually. Wow. All right. Well, there goes part one of the challenge, guys. Part two is going to be uh, who can catch the biggest fish. Let's keep that one the bait and let that one go. What are they saying? 
Yeah. There we go. I got one. Finally. I got, all right. First fish of the day for me. Before we go for the big fish, I had to catch something on the, uh, the little artificial. That's bigger than mine. Yeah, it's a good hand-sized white perch right here. So I switched it up. The spinner was not working out, so I'm using a uh, little two-inch gold minnow on a uh, small jig head. I think it's quarter ounce. Just jigging along the bottom. I'm gonna catch one more fish. Then we're gonna go for the. Uh, then we go for the big ones. Watch this. See a couple of fish right here. Oh, oh, they're, they're spooked. Oh, he took it. Holy sh! What the hell is that? Damn. Yeah, I'm gonna set you up in a second. Hold on. Let me see what this fish is right here. Oh, the nail in it right here. Hey, that. Look. The, oh, oh. There's a, a ton. That drop your bait right there. There's like. Drop it right there. Like, don't don't let go all the way down. Just hold it like. Yeah, just hold it like right there. Look. You'll see him come up. He got the uh, blood. You like that blood? Let's see what the. Uh, oh, you right got him on the drop. All right. What do you got? Oh, he's off again. <laughs> what the heck? You know what? He's biting the worm, but he's. I got him. I got him. He's Let's see what we got here. He's biting. Woo! He's biting the worm, all but right. he's not. Uh, Fish on, fish on! All right, we got a school of white on. perch here. Woo, I got him this time, baby. That's a good one. We moved to deeper water, and we have a whole school of white perch here. So that's a good sign that hopefully there's some stripers here as well. Yeah, this is a good one too. All right, that's what those fish were. I just saw a bunch of fish that lined up, just lined up right along the wall here. It's very unusual. I'm literally just dropping my bait. Oh, he took. He's on it. He got it. Oh, he, he bit it. He bit it and let go. So many fish right here. It's oh. got. <laughs> you right? I almost got hooked. Oh, that Careful, Dad. That All right. Let me catch one more. Uh, uh, I, oh, oh, my gosh. I'm going crazy right here. <laughs> yeah, you might need your eye protection. I'm getting a little, getting a little, a little over eager right here. And these fish are big though right here. This is fun. Oh, he took it. It's big. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. See a little dude. If this small fish, guys, the big fish can't be far behind. That is a real good sign. Yeah, we could get a whole bucket full of white perch if we wanted to. Yeah. But those fish it would be very tedious to clean. I don't, I don't time to clean them. I yeah. Them I try to get and meet my patients before o'clock. Oh, yeah. I mean, it should be pretty... Oh, look, the striper! Nope. The striper by it! The striper! Look at that! Yeah, put your, no, put your, put your, um, put your blood worm... Pull it, pull it up, pull up, pull, pull your blood worm up. Yep. The striper right by it. All right, the striper's here, Dad. Was a striper going for the yeah? It's going for the fish. What? It wasn't big though. It was a small striper. I'm gonna put a, I'm gonna put a live. Uh, a yeah. Live. All right. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Striper time. It's big fish time. Let go of my grub. Uh, See you, buddy. I mean, those little perch fish. Be All right, guys. Action's popping off. Dad, what baiting you use first? Michael, I already won the first challenge like in three minutes. I don't want to drag this out for you. I'm going with the big gun. I'm going with the eel, the action bait. Action bait? All right, where are they at? Oh, they're in here. All right, let's pull them out. There he is. He's ready. This guy's major league ready. You ready, buddy? Oh, my gosh. I don't, oh, my God. There he goes. There he <laughs> oh, goes. Perfect size. Save please. some of your action. Don't let him go in the hole, Dad. We were last, I, I don't last want, time. I don't want him to go in the hole. Oh, don't, don't go in the hole. No, 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 no. Not the hole, Dad. No. If we lose him, we already lost one. Come on. All right, I got, got the sucker him? now. All right, do you know? Do you want me to hook him for you? Or can you do it? I graduated from college. <laughs> well, this isn't rocket science, but yeah, I don't know how good your outdoor skills are. I'll do a quick, quick form, just like that. Oh, perfect! That's how you do it, baby. All right, let go. Woo! All right, <laughs> money zone. All right, we're going out. Let's see it. All right, drop it in there. We're going deep. So my dad's starting with the eel. I'm gonna go with the plastic that the bait store attendee recommended, which is uh, this BDK lure, durable soft plastic, completely unscented, no scent on it whatsoever. So this is a 100% artificial bait, rig it on a half ounce bucktail, and we're gonna see how this does. All right, there it is. Let's see how this guy does. Who will get the first striper of the day? Yeah. That's correct. Crab right there on the island. Oh, let's crab? Ah, uh, let's get it. Very good, ready? Right in the oh. money zone. I see him. He's moving. 
I got a visual. He's moving. He knows we're here. Ah, got him! Let's go, baby! Woo, that's a there crab catch. There we go. Look at that guy. Let's go ahead and get this guy out of the net. Can you tell? I think it's a, from the marking on the bottom. Is that a female? Do you know how to tell the difference between a female and a female? I have no idea how to tell. Look at the bottom. Okay. The bottom, or no, that's a male. Male? I'm not sure. It might be a male. It kind of looks like a penis. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Is that why? Yeah, I think so. All right, yeah. let's get him out of the net. I don't think they can pinch you, right, Dad? If you grab them behind? Oh my, I, I'll tell you what, I, 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 would, I would use a knife to flip them over. Let's see, we're gonna test it, guys. Let's see if crabs can pinch you from this angle. It's my right hand. Oh my goodness. Woo! Oh. Oh, yeah, they can't. Oh, I'm yeah. safe. Woo! All right, there he is, guys, in all his glory. Mr. Krabs. Should um, we take him home and put it in our fish tank? All right, Mr. Krabs. I'm gonna let you go now. Ready? Off you go. Oh, swim backwards. Good action on that guy. All right, back to fishing. Neither of us have caught a striper yet. We really need a good fish. What? You got one? Fish on! Oh! What? Is it actually a fish? Fish on! You sure? You're not snagged, are you? Wait, it's your own fish! <laughs> what the f***, dude? Alright, let me show you how to... You reel it in a little bit? No, you don't reel in at all. Alright, let me teach you. you. Yeah, let me show you how to do this. Holy s***. Alright, reel it in. No, there's no fish on. Fish on! There's no fish on. Oh, wait. Fish on! Wait, oh, wait, you, oh, you do have a fish on, what? Fish on, striper! Alright, all right, stop that, wait, wait, wait. You got a little striper, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Oh, you do actually have a striper. Alright, it's swam. Wait, did you lose it? What the Wait, you tangled up there. What the Wait, you lost the fish. No, I got a, I got a hand line. I hand line it. You lost it. What? You freaking lost it. You lost the striper, Dad. How'd that happen? <laughs> you got tangled up in the top. Let me see. Somehow. What the hell happened? All right, all right. Well, at least we're getting bites now. What happened? You got a massive tangle up top. I don't how know how. Happened? I don't know, but it's cute. Oh it's, my God. All right, I'm gonna. Striper. You did. All right, that's a good sign, at least. Damn it. That's a good sign. A striper. All right, Dad. You have not had good luck this morning. What's your? Uh, what are you gonna do differently to hook your next fish? Hopefully. I'm gonna try to do a better hook set. Better hook I'm set? Stand up. Uh, yeah, you should be standing up. I'm trying to do an Olympic hook set. Olympic, all right. Good luck. When should I flip the bale? When it hits the bottom. When the bait hits the bottom. It probably hit the bottom. You can probably flip the bale. All right. Should I reel it in stay a alert. Bit? Yeah, stay alert. Look for that bite. Reel it in a little bit? Yeah. Uh huh. When do I stop reeling? When, it, when it's, not, when it's semi tight. My dad got hit on the fall and he's using a uh, live spot. So, here's what I'm going to do right here I'm going to use a spot imitation, kind of. A nice, uh, five inch tsunami swim shad right here and we're gonna see if we can conclude this live bait versus artificial challenge to see uh, which bait is truly the best no you don't have a fish it's it's a regular fish sure. I mean it's possible fish on fish on, fish on. Fish on. oh wait you do have a fish holy oh, crap striper. what striper what? Oh, whoa! Whoa! Striper! <laughs> I told you! I felt something! It wasn't a false alarm! It was not the boy that cried off! Woo! I, I did it! I beat you in both challenges! You did beat me! Holy crap! I can't believe, I can't believe it. it! Look at that hook set! Wow! Look at that hook set! Wow! That's an Olympic hook set right there! You know there. what's crazy? That's an Olympic hook set! I'll give you credit on that one, Dad. Nah. He's probably not big enough to keep those. Gotta be no, yeah, he's not, we're not keeping them anyways. Measure no. Yeah, we'll measure him. I mean, this fish ate, ate a freaking... Oh my God, I oh knew my. I had, I felt heavy. He ate a fish that's this big. I don't even know how he fit it in there. I mean... That's incredible. It was crazy. Woo! Dang, Dad. This is a, it's not a huge one, but it's something. I mean, it was crazy. It was like, I, the pole didn't bend that much, but it felt heavy coming in. Yeah. Dang, I you did have one. I had like 500 false alarms today, so I didn't <laughs> want to yell out too loud, but I was like, dude, I was like, this feels heavy. Uh, oh my gosh, 19. 19 inches? A little over 19. All right, 19, 19 inches. Woo! All right, well, hey, we're going to let this guy go. But uh, you know what? We got to go for a bigger fish, Dad. 19 inches is good, but we got to go for one. Let's go for one over 22 now. Guys, the condition out here gotten really, really rough. And in fact, we had to waste three hours because our boat broke down and we had to get rescued and given a new motor that didn't suck. So it has not been an easy day, but we're catching fish. I know. 
Holy These are some big ass swells, dude. What the heck? These are giant. Holy moly. Oh. All right, guys. I'm about to throw up, get seasick out here. I think we're gonna call it a day. Thanks for watching, and uh, there will definitely be some more saltwater fishing challenges in the future. <laughs>